and we would hold hands before the angel revelation scene each week and we would pray and our prayer always was that there would be less of us and more of God less of us more of you we would pray so that we learned just to get out of the way and we have taken that prayer Mark and I have taken that prayer into all these projects that we work on together as well we we haven't started any of these projects and resurrection of course included that it didn't begin with prayer, that there would be less of us, that there would be more of God. Can I ask you about your book, Roma? <laughs> I, I notice your, oh, yes. I, I notice your, your butterfly necklace and uh, <laughs> so we, we interviewed you on TBN a while back on Box of Butterflies. If somebody reads Box of Butterflies, what, what is the overarching message for that, uh, what, you're, what you're talking about in that book? Oh gosh, it really, um, I guess, you know, I, I would describe it as a spiritual memoir. So it's the story of events from my life, but how, how God was always there, you know, how God was always there. So it may be best summed up by, you're familiar with the, the beautiful little um, reflection about the footprints on the beach. And, you know, the, the person who says, God, when I needed you the most, why is there only one set of footprints? And and Jesus replies, because that's when I carried you. So it was really me um, going back over the stories of my life and, and re realizing and remembering that in all of those moments, the good and the bad, the good, the bad, and the ugly, that, um, that I didn't walk alone in any of that and how grateful I am to God, how grateful I am. What's your biggest uh, overarching memory of playing an angel for all those years on Touched by an Angel? Well, you know, as a believer, Matt, it was such a privilege for me to be the messenger, to be able to deliver a message of God's love every week to millions of people. Um, at the height of its success, Touched by an Angel was watched by 25 million people each week. And beating Survivor. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I believe that people tuned in to hear the central theme of the, of the show, which was that there is a God and that he loves us and that he wants to be part of our lives. And, you know, I had a tremendous um, close and wonderful friendship with Della Reese, uh, who played the angel Tess opposite my angel Monica. And we would hold hands before the angel revelation scene each week, and we would pray. And our prayer always was that there would be less of us and more of God, less of us, more of you, we would pray, so that we learned just to get out of the way. And we have taken that prayer, Mark and I have taken that prayer, into all these projects that we work on together as well. We, we haven't started any of these projects, and resurrection, of course, included that it didn't begin with prayer, yeah. that there would be less of us, that there would be more of God, so that, you know, that film could go out into the world and touch people, transform hearts, open hearts, and bring people closer to him. That's the intention, mm -hmm. that would bring people closer to God. At TBN, our mission is to use every available means to reach as many individuals and families as possible with the life-changing gospel of Jesus Christ. Thank you for helping make the gospel of grace go around the world. Without you, we couldn't do it. God bless you.